So we just got done with dinner, and now we're sitting here on the couch watching Chicago, one of the Chicago shows. There's so many Chicago Med, Chicago PD, Chicago Fire. I think this is Chicago Men. We're sitting here. Uh, honey, we should be snuggling. Come back here. We're sitting here snuggling, um, watching TV, so we're going to, it's about 7 o'clock, we're just going to give you a tour of our, not a tour, what's the word I'm looking for, a glimpse into our bedtime routine and our evenings together. So nightly routine, the dogs lay like this, I sit on the couch, Not working. Oh. Typically, don't Yeah, eat. typical night. Internet doesn't work. Dominique is getting ready to do her yoga. Day six! With Adrian. Subscribe or subscribe to that whole um, obsession. Um, but I this do is my, to my core, and I would like this to is my yoga mat. My abs, my abdominals, it's green. My it looks like grass. Do you want to look at my toes? Because they're real messy. Can we zoom in? Don't zoom in so, there, bro. She's doing the 30 day yoga challenge. I think it was from last year. Well, it doesn't matter. It's still 30 days. If you have a block, you might grab it. It might be handy. I don't have a block. That's our next purchase. That's my shoe. Um, I don't know just, if my imagination is really going to work. So, uh, if you have one, grab it now. If not, it's okay. You're going to do a little yoga for the imagination. So, let's meet in a flat back position here. Hug the knees into the chest and take a nice full breath in. I feel like the dogs judge you. I am so grateful. I feel like so you judge me. I don't judge you because I can't do it either. And to I feel like Taffy stares at you like, Mom, you're doing the downward facing dog wrong. Get back to our finest Ruest selves. So some of these moves may feel like, uh, is this yoga, Adrian? And I'm like, yeah, everything to me counts as yoga if I'm connecting. Every so time she does yoga, yoga I feel like I have to eat. So use that block, keep the I know block. I'm such good support because I sit here and I eat. So I'm going to eat my cornflakes. I also have to say, we've been buying these mandarins. Okay, I don't like mandarin oranges when they're in fruit cups. I don't know why, but I don't like mandarin oranges in fruit cups. However, those are awesome, and I eat like three or four a day. Okay, there's my cornflakes again, so I'm gonna go eat those. Although typically not part of our nightly routine, we went out and got one of these things. Because who didn't go out and get one of these things? With our 1 in 292 million chance of actually winning, why not? And we got a couple of scratch-offs, and if it's any consolation, we did not win any money on the scratch-offs. But, if you're all playing, good luck. I hope somebody gets it. And if you get it, try not to spend it all on something completely ridiculous. You can spend some of it. But try not to spend all of it. What? I'm not meant to have a six pack. Release, cross the right ankle over the left. Oh! Right the feet. Hurt you? Rock a little front to back. Fun and back and forth. It does hurt my body. body. <laughs> and then we'll rock all the way up to a nice cross-legged position. We're gonna sit up nice. How's it going? For obvious reasons, I'm going to send the right leg out long. I'm going to bring the block underneath the left. And then I'm going to switch. But you don't have a block. Like we're bobbing a basketball in between. So you want the peep? Knee, I'm going to inhale, exhale, lift my head, neck, and shoulders. Passing through. So we have variation one, variation two. Keep it going. Variation three is to come up into more Navasana, lifting up through the spine and working here. Happy, what do you think? What's she what doing? Heck, Adrian, I said I didn't have a block. You can do this with anything. 
Do you want the peep? But you can do this, use this alligator. Or just use the alligator. Just that works scissors. too. If you don't have a block, you can work on scissors. So we're again imagining that block going through. Hi. So we're going to work here for about 10 breaths in your variation. What's this one called? Hey, my friends, welcome to day seven of oh. Yoga with Adrian. I'm Adrian. Adrian! Quit! Today our practice is like Why do you just play? For the seventh day. Where's the remote? Seven's a little bit longer than seven minutes. But we can do it. How was it? Everyone, you know when you see yoga on TV? This is how yoga really is. This is what it makes you feel like. You know what I was thinking? Is it normal for me to be doing yoga in my glasses? Otherwise, I couldn't see the television. You are blind without your glasses. I mean, do people do yoga in their glasses? They might. People that can't see anything, yeah. There you go. Question, everyone. Do you do yoga? Do you wear your glasses? They probably don't even wear glasses. Time for a quick clean up. So we just got in a mild disagreement because, because she never takes the trash out. I don't want to. I don't like to. Why? Because I don't. Because I know she'll do it. Why should I if I know she will? Okay, so she's in the shower. I'm still, I'm filming. I'll get in the shower here in a minute. Um, I'm pretty sure. We like to conserve water. Yeah, conserve water. Uh, our daughter is laying in, you know, what she thinks is her bed. Kinda. It's not your bed. So, yep. Yeah. We're showering. Pretty much. That looks scary yet. Not yet. Raccoon. Not yet. Oh, that's surprising. A little bit, but so yeah. Um. Okay. It's a shower. Not much to talk about there. So after we get out of the shower, I like to brush my hair with this comb. This is a wet comb. It gets on my shingles. Then I like to lotion myself up with Cashmere Glow Ultra Sheer. Just some old lotion that we probably got for Christmas three years ago. And we got more this year. And I'm trying to use it up. Because we got more. <laughs> and then, I like to dabble on a little Jergens face cream. This is for if you're 50 or over. But we like to use it. That's because... the greatest stuff ever. And it smells like old woman. Older. It smells, but it's so and wonderful. And then, I like to put on... Avino Active Natural Smart Essentials Anti-Fatigue Eye Cream. And as you can see, even China likes it from the bite marks. She hates life right now. And he's just... Happy, are you dead? Nope, nope, we have movement. And then, because I have massive cystic zits, I like to use Mario Badescu drying lotion to dry those suckers up and then they're gone in the morning. Available at Ulta. Jergens. <laughs> Anna, what? What? Did you call it Pons or Jergens? It's Jergens. I nor I normally call it Pons. I don't really use a lot of that. You see it? It's pink. Deep cleansing. Okay, so basically the point of this is to remove makeup. And you can put it as a base for makeup. Check out that hair. I know. Isn't it beautiful? Because, you know, I don't use this comb. Why I, not? Try it. Look at... My hair looks like an... I look like an emo kid once I get out of the shower. Like... I think you need to put something in it. Put a little of this oil in it. Like, wait, are you... Put a, just a little tiny bit. So many things. I, I, need, I have to help her. I do. Just put a, the tiniest little amount and run it through your hair. Can I drop it in my hands? Yeah. Just let me let me look at what you got going on. 
Okay, that's good. This is what we like to call a smidge. <laughs> now run the, Yeah, now run it in your hair. Basically, more on the, that, yeah, that ends on, on the other side. You need a haircut. I'm bringing that, I'm bringing it back. I'm bringing back emo right here. My life is so sad. <laughs> Not for real. I know there's kids out there that are actually really upset. I was there at one point, but I was there 10 years ago, kids. 10 years ago. More than I was that. in the screamo scene, people. The screamo. She's real life. Real life. Um, look at her. She puts her anti aging. Anna, how old are you? Tell I'm the camera. How old you are? I will be 29 this year. Woo. 29. And let me tell you, everyone. And looking fine. Let me tell you. Doesn't look a day over 22. Let me tell you how this goes in case there's, you know. I didn't think about getting old <laughs> until I hit 25. And then I'm like, man, I'm going to be 30 in five years. That's okay. Because at 25, I still got, well, you don't look a day over 16. Now, I don't get that anymore. And let me tell you, I got wrinkles. I got dry skin. Let's look at those wrinkles. Let's not. You can't even see them. I got wrinkles around my mouth right here. I got super dry skin. I have adult acne. Didn't have acne in high school. It exists, people. Adult acne is a real thing. It is real. So I have adult acne, wrinkles, dry skin. I feel like I'm 85 because I can't move half the time. I'm falling apart. So what? Do, I'm telling you, it's downhill at some point. You may not hit it yet, but it's coming. You put that on your neck, too? <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> Do you think it helps firm it up? It needs help. <laughs> this right here, you see this? This is all going to go. It's all going to go. <laughs> going to go downwards. It huh? is. It's going, it's go I'm going to look like, what's that dog? Droopy. Remember that one? Probably. Women's Daily Gummies. The CVS brand. For my... My, see, in my family, my dad's side, they all lived really long lives. Like, 90s. They all lived in their 90s. However, his aunts were also like this. So, <laughs> drinking pints of beer and smoking cigarettes. Turn to the side and hunch over. So, I take my women's daily gummies. CVS brand, because they're cheaper. To help with my... Probably gonna have osteoporosis in my body. But... Getting on top of this now. They're a little hard. Yeah, I think yours are stale. I'm good till next year. Hmm. You like this? You like all of this? That's pretty nice, huh? This is some drying lotion for all my zits. Mm. Looks pretty good. Same. What time do you wake up? What do you wake? wake? Uh, I wake up at two because it takes me probably forty-five minutes to actually get out of bed. Yeah, because you gotta lay there and look at your phone for you a little to. bit. You know, because a lot of stuff happens at two o'clock in the morning. And midnight, people post at midnight. And I gotta check our Powerball numbers. Yeah, that's true. I gotta make sure we're not. Are you gonna wake me up at four millionaires? Uh, yeah, probably. Okay. What is it? What is it? I don't know. What is it? It looks like, did you open something earlier? What does it look like? Paper. Wet paper. And you know, I just love wet paper. Ew. Yeah. So. What are you having? Uh, my nightly tea. On. How many days in a row now have you had tea? I don't know. 
I don't know what. Why did I even start drinking tea? I have no idea. I I think I had needed help sleeping, and I knew we had this bedtime blend tea, and yeah, I don't know. It's now a habit. I have to have tea. So on top of my Jergens facial cream that makes me smell like I am. And she's only been drinking tea every night for like two or three weeks. Tea. And you see, we have a Keurig, and notice that I don't use the Keurig. I. Do it the old-fashioned way. I steep my tea. Is that what it's called? Steep? Steep. Three to five minutes. Yes, it's a steeping. I didn't know that. Who needs that when you have a Keurig in your life? You know, that Keurig... It's so old-fashioned. I know. I like doing things the old-fashioned way. Your lips look ruby red in this They're camera. very chapped, actually. That's the... I gotta put some <laughs> chapstick on. <laughs> Let me just get myself into position. China hates this. Look. <laughs> China, what's going on? Now my legs are raising. We have a hospital bed. Yeah. That's that's what this well, is. No, it's a Tempur-Pedic. It's a hospital bed. But it, yeah, it's for, you know, people over 50 often have this. Even though it sounds like it's going to... Yeah, break it's very all crappy, of a sudden. It has like a lifetime warranty, so we'll have it for a lifetime. So here we are in our bed. What do we do next? Next, we read. Now I want to tell them the story about what I did to you in the shower. Okay, so do you want to tell it? I'll tell it. So a couple days ago, we were taking a shower, and. She is brushing her teeth because we, we brush our teeth in, in the shower, but she's brushing her teeth and I'm like, oh, I forgot to tell you, the other day I saw some rust in the shower, so I cleaned it off with your toothbrush. And she just stands there <laughs> and she's like, what'd you say? I don't know, but you were pissed. I, I was, because you were like, why would you use my toothbrush to okay. do that? Because I'm already, I'm weird, okay? I'm weird about my teeth, and I'm weird about my toothbrush. Like, I'm one of those people, like, I usually will change my toothbrush out close to the when I, the timeline I'm supposed to, according to my dentist. <laughs> <laughs> just, I mean, just, that's good. It's good, but it's a little, it's a little uh -huh. much. But I'm pretty, yeah, no, she, and the thing is, when Dominique likes to tell stories like that, she keeps a completely straight I'm face. I'm really good at showing. And she'll, she'll stick with it, too. I, if she could have had me going probably all day. But I was getting ready to use her toothbrush to write, wipe away some other rust that would happen to... No, you were going to do something gross with it. Oh, where the caulking yeah. is at. We've, yeah, we have to do the caulk in there, and she was going to scrub in <laughs> the caulk. Ew. Mm. So then I had to fast that before she did something. Cause that's just China. You just love bedtime, huh? It's China's favorite time of the day. He loves kisses too. They wake up at like six in the morning, wanting food. Okay, I have to read my book. Do you want to know what I'm reading? I'm reading. It's a book called. I think it's got two different names, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, two different names. Uh, one of them is I think H two O. Basically, it's about it's a young adult book because I'm, that's her I'm, favorite i'm a young adult there basically if it is young adult and has to do with anything to deal with survival she'll read it yeah i like like i like walking dead I like all that kind of her stuff. favorite movie is 2012 yeah 2012 poseidon poseidon I like that stuff disasters i don't know why but i love it so it's about rain it's like Poison, and if it gets on you, then you're dead. It's so good. Yeah. Come to bed. And I'd show you my book that I'm reading. But she also likes to paint everything in our house. I thought I was being crafty and clever. So, there's my book. You can kind of see it through the light. But, it's Fried Green Tomatoes at the Whistle Stop Cafe. Because... 
That's an awesome movie. It's like the oldest lesbian movie ever. It's there are prob- lesbians. Probably not. I know they're. Don't spoil it for people that haven't seen it or read it. Well, well, that's our candle. It's in our little table, just adorbs. Our lamp Did you know I almost dusty. broke the lamp the other day? I would have killed you. It, I it went right here, and I I I dove for like, it. I don't think you understand. I would have killed I, you. It was when I was trying to put that up on the window, and the, I hit the table, and it went. It went over, and I literally dove. Like, I was diving, and I caught it right here, and I saved it. Do you remember when I was yelling the other day, and I said, got it? Got it. That's why. Because I it almost went off the... Yeah. I think that would have been... Cause for divorce. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm going to get in bed, because... I don't know if you can see that. It's like 9 o'clock. It says 9.32, but that... It's... It's 20 minutes past. 30, actually. So, it's 9 o'clock. I gotta be up in, like, 5 hours. So, I'm gonna go to bed. Say goodnight. She's reading. She won't listen to anything I say. I could tell her some big, long story right now. Right now? I don't know. The power just went out. And so, like, I'm so cold. Um, but goodnight. We'll see you later. If you have any ideas for some new vids, let us know. And sorry that the quality is kind of eh right now. We're we're new at this. And we have to use our cell phones because our computer is ancient. It's, it's not, not really. We have it's a, not a MacBook that's a 2009. But it's been it's seen better days. Yeah. I spilled coffee on it one time. <laughs> and it's seen better days since then. So we have to do it this way for right now. But yeah. Yeah. If you'd like us to talk about anything, we'll talk about it. Pop culture, books, life, makeup. This is the makeup guru here. If you'd like to ask her. <laughs> yeah, not really. <laughs> um, I don't have much talent in anything, so. Anna knows a lot about, like, movies. Like, when we watch a movie, I'm like, oh, what's that actor? And she'll tell you. Then she'll tell you who they're married to and who their ex-husband is and yeah I don't know why and what they're hot like I don't know I don't know how she knows like she's she knows a lot about pop useless culture. information if you have any sort of, and she also knows how slugs mate I do but that's real fascinating I'll google it just google it if yeah. you ever want to know Google's a fantastic thing but yeah any sort of useless information I am like the useless information Google here. I, I, it, that's, I don't know why. That's why I did so well in school because I retained everything that I was not supposed to retain. But we're getting in bed now. She's gonna pass out in probably five minutes, and I'm gonna drink my tea. My tea. Then I'm probably gonna rinse the mug out and use tomorrow morning for coffee. <laughs> Are you really? Yeah. Gotham needs me tomorrow. <laughs> Okay. Good night. Good night.